What's up guys, my name is Dale, a fitness and bodywork specialist out here in Southern California. Today we are with Sadie. Hello. Um, we're going to do a couple things for her. Um, we're going to address her um, what's called IT band syndrome, really common um, thing most people experience with knee pain. Um, and then a little bit of shoulder stuff for her. So uh, first we're going to do um, lower body, so let's get to it. Yay! <laughs> so go ahead and lay face up for me. Head over here? Yeah, head right there for me. Okay. Ooh. And then, so a big, what's it called? A symptom of IT band syndrome is outside knee pain. Um, outside um, lower, or I'm sorry, upper half outside knee pain. Um, typically when you're standing or working out or even walking. And a lot of people feel the pain on their IT band. The issue is actually the hip flexors at the top. So it's going to be your TFL and upper glute. So Sadie, that's what I'm going to do to you. Awesome. <laughs> TFL and awesome. upper glute. <laughs> and then I'll try to address that knee pain for you. Okay. So let me still check the hamstrings first. Always checking the hips to see where everything's at. You are actually pretty good. I've been I've been really good about stretching. <laughs> okay, this is tight though. Okay, I did though. legs this morning. Oh, did you? Oh, I remember you wake up very early. Yeah, I do. Okay, glutes are tight. And then side hip flexor. Wow, internal rotations. Okay, but well, that's part of the issue. Take a deep breath. Exhale. Lower right side back. So this is just the initial stretches so I can kind of gauge how her hips feel. Everything feels okay, but glutes were tight for sure. Rotation's okay. So we're going to start with the TFL here. Your TFL is a internal rotator. So it does this to your leg. And so to get it to stretch, we got to do the opposite of it. So here comes some pressure, Sadie. And then you're going to help me with this external rotation. Good job. And we'll work our way up. How's the pressure? It's good. Nothing's hurting yet. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hungry. Am I allowed to talk? Yeah, of course. Okay. On it, talk as you are. Did you hear my stomach? <laughs> Wait, what's your name again? No, don't talk to him. Okay. <laughs> okay, I won't talk to him. <laughs> Broke the fourth wall. Okay, leg off the table for me. I'm gonna do some rotations there. Uh, let's move the hip just a little bit over, right there. Okay, so here, and then we Ooh. externally rotate. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Externals this way. Good. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I is, can definitely. It is feel tight it. on you. There you go. So there, here comes the pressure. I'll ease up the pressure a little bit and ease into it. So working on that TFL, right now just internally ro rotating and then externally rotating. It's pretty sensitive at the lower part, huh? <laughs> Whoa, is that your quad or is that? Let's see. Wait, what did you lift? Legs, quads? Um, glutes and hammies glutes this and morning, hammies. yeah. Quads should be good then. I'm doing a lot of stairs though. What's your cardio at? She has me at 500 cals, cals? a day. So I split it. 500 is, wait, 30 minutes is 300. So an hour, it's almost an hour. It takes me about 23 minutes to do 250. Oh, that's cause you're so efficient now. So I split it morning and night and two spin classes a week. Oh my God. Yeah. 
I mean, that's pretty fun. Yeah, I love spin class. Okay, so let's get the leg up. Is it grit? Yeah. Nice. Oh yeah, that's also very close by. That's part of my bubble. <laughs> Your bubble. <laughs> Okay, so blading TFL. So it's this little, little corner piece on the top of her leg. And then I'll go cross fiber right after it. How's the pressure? It's good. You are just chilling right now. <laughs> You'll hear me laugh when it hurts. Usually, like that's my nervous, uh, my nervous. What I do when I when it hurts, you know. Yeah. <laughs> that's a panic attack. Laughing is a panic attack. <laughs> what muscle is that? This right here. Yeah. Your it's called your tensor fascia latte. TFL. Is that part of the quad? It goes on top of the quad. Okay. It goes, um, this is the one that attaches to your IT band and your glute. So okay. that's why to get this to loosen up your knee, mm -hmm. let me backtrack. To address your IT band, you should mobilize these two muscles. Okay. You should really never roll your IT band out because it's not a muscle to stretch. Got it. But this gets tight just from sitting. But for you, because you're doing stairs a lot, I'm pretty sure it's, that has something to do with it. Yeah. Okay, let's go across now. I have noticed I've been doing like 30 minutes of stretching after oh my, my cardio at night, and I've been like sleeping way better. Yeah. Honestly, more people should stretch before they sleep. Yeah. I definitely notice a difference. Okay, let's start here and then slowly a little bit outward. So I'm going to take this, I'm going to just rotate your leg like that, okay? Okay. So let's go internal first, and then external. Nice. Internal, external, nice job. How's the pre ooh, little knot there. <laughs> How's that? Did you feel that? Yeah. Well, oh, might need to get the cup on there. Okay, so you have to tell me, why do you eat all your meals with chopsticks? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I just, I feel like, I don't know, I just feel like it's more enjoyable than a boring <laughs> fork or spoon, you know? Yeah. I don't know why. I started doing that like a year ago. Really? Yeah. It's so funny, actually. Yeah. I mean, typically it's only like Asian food that you eat with chopsticks, you know? You can eat anything with chopsticks. Yeah, you can. Are you part Asian? Well, my father is, has some Vietnamese in him. Oh, gotcha. But I grew up with mom, so I consider myself Latina. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Okay. So here, and then your externals, the stretch. And then I'm going to take it down a little bit. Externals, the stretch, and then a little lengthen. That feels good, actually. Good. It should. It shouldn't have hurt. Well, sometimes it hurts. Yeah.
Okay, I'm gonna hold this one here. Okay, one more. External, and we're coming down. Nice job. Oof. Okay, let's go off the table again. So here, internal and external. Good. Internal and external. How does it feel? It feels interesting. Like it's more mobile now. <laughs> I didn't realize how tight it was actually. Honestly, a lot of bikini girls have this because of um, if you're doing the good girl, bad girl machine a lot, yeah. like abduction or abduction, mm -hmm. you fire this. If you do, if you do it wrong, you'll fire this a lot yeah. instead of this, instead of your glutes. Oh yeah. So I'm just gonna go on the outer quad now, following the IT band. Okay. I mostly do the bad girl ones. <laughs> Would you consider yourself a bad girl? No, actually, I'm more on the good side. <laughs> but with that, I feel like I don't need to grow my inner thighs anymore. They're already pretty thick, you know? Yeah. Holy <laughs> shit. You didn't know, huh? What's that? You didn't know how tight this was here? No. Well, you did also just train legs, so maybe here a little. Yeah tight from that. Okay, because we're doing outer quad, you're gonna help me with this one. Okay. So basically what I need, let's start here and just bring your leg up for me, okay? Okay. I'm gonna follow you up, basically. Okay, go ahead, follow it up. And down, I'll follow you. Good job. 10, following, nine, eight, Seven, good. Six, five, four, three, two, last one. And I know, one, good job. Okay, cross. Holy shit. <laughs> oh, fuck. Is it tickle? A little bit. On a scale of one to ten? Um, like a seven. It's pretty gnarly. Okay, let me get this out of the way. I'm gonna, we're gonna roll to your left. Okay. And then we'll get that top side boot now. Go ahead. This way? Or this Towards way? the, your left. My left. Got it. Yeah. Thank you. And then let's go leg. Make sure the leg comes off the table so it come close to me. Perfect, right there. So I'm gonna do leg straight on the bottom. Perfect. And then knee bend. Okay, we're gonna go here for the glute. Pressure and then We'll basically work down the glute meat this way. Whoa. <laughs> Tight. You can feel it right away, huh? Oh, yeah. Also, because you tried to kick me. <laughs> <laughs> that little flinch. I'm like trying to relax as much as I can. that comes off creepy when I whisper like that. No, <laughs> it doesn't. It's crazy how your body naturally, like when it's tight, it fights back, right? Oh yeah, I mean, I'm digging my elbow into you. If <laughs> someone was digging their arm into me, I'd fight back too. <laughs> but it's like natural instinct. Yeah, 
which is why I think like massaging and like this stuff, like who figured this out? Yeah. I'm just going to put pressure with my elbow and it's going to give you alleviation somehow. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's stay on the spot. I'm going to do some rotations here. Okay. So pressure and then external. Oop. Was that okay on your knee? Yeah. Okay, here, external. Good. External. Good. Let's do a couple more. External. Definitely getting easier. Okay, let's go from here. So I'm going to try to get that glute med to fire. Um, okay. Push up into my hand. Three, two, one, relax. Good job. I'll do five reps, okay? Okay. Hold on. Get right there. Good. Three, two, one, relax. Nice. Very accurate. Fire. Three, two, one, relax. Two more. Fire. Three, two, one, relax. And one more. Three, two, one, relax. Wow, well, very accurate. Uh, <laughs> leg straight again. This one here, and then bend this one. Nice. 